But let's just uh, turn our attention to another piece of news that is creating quite a buzz. Tanisha Chatterjee, whose uh, new film Posh is making headlines, says she had a rather unpleasant experience on a show which was meant to roast her. It was meant to be a comedy show. Instead, she says it was anything but funny. Tanishta is in fact joining me on the program. Tanishta, hi. Uh, thanks for speaking to us. We've been going through your uh, the Facebook post that you put up. It, it does sound rather horrific. But tell me one thing. Uh, was the entire the entire time that you spent there was that just spent talking about the color of your skin or joking about it yeah i mean the surprising thing is that the only thing they found uh, worth roast in me was my skin tone and i sat through the first segment and i waited uh, through the second segment as well um, to figure out whether whether there would be something else that they find worth roasting about me but unfortunately that never came which is uh, I mean, and that was the point where I decided that you know I can't be a, a party to this and I've come to promote a film called Parched there which actually talks about a lot of these deep issues and it's I cannot be you know stooping down to that level just to promote my film that I I don't even stand for the things that my film stands for and that I stand for as an artist Right, fair enough. Uh, so I had to, and I spoke to them. I spoke to them about it. The funny thing is that they didn't even get what I'm saying. So what was their response? Because uh, you have, of course, also said that it was meant to be a comedy show. When you brought it up, they said, didn't you know that you were here for a roast? So when you sort of pointed it out and tried to underscore what was happening and why you were uncomfortable with, with the kind of jokes that, that were doing the rounds, what was the response? Yeah, the response initially was that, okay, fine, you know, why don't you just shoot the exit? You know, you take your exit. And I'm like, do you get what I'm trying to say? Mm. Then the second response was, okay, sh do you want us to change uh, the roasting that we're doing with you? We'll change it. We'll also do other things. And then I tried to explain to them that who writes your content? Mm. Do you understand the definition of satire? Do you understand the definition of roast? Have you seen roasts? Mm. I tried to explain to them that this is the dictionary meaning, that please understand what a roast means. Mm. A roast is a counterpoint to a toast, toasting mm. somebody's life. You know, it's boring to probably say you're great. So you right. make fun of that person's, person's mm. work, person's sure. contribution, sure. something like that. But they, I wish they were making fun of me. They were not making fun of me. Mm. They were talking about a deep prejudice, mm. which right from our childhood we've heard. This is not making fun of me. Mm. It just sort of... Uh, Shows, you know how so they didn't the, even get what I'm just, saying. Finally, when I said to them that why, why didn't you make fun of me? I'm here mm. to be roasted. Mm. Have but they this, been in? Has they, there been any looking at me like this? So <laughs> has there been Tarishta any contact that you've had with the organizers of the show, with those responsible for the show, ever since you put that Facebook post out there? Because that, that is, of course, you've made your outrage pretty clear, very apparent in that. Have they tried to reach out to you since? No, they haven't because I do think that this is like really beyond just me. Mm. It's been going on forever and in 2016, I still have to talk to you, Namrata, on this show and be apologetic about my skin tone, explain my stand about a comedy show. I think it's appalling. Right. I think we are still in this state. That is appalling. That and is my point is true. that. My point is that it's really... That is, of yeah. course, very my true. And it is, is the reality of me. India, Tanishtha. It's, it's, it's the sad reality of India, even in the 21st century, that the color of the skin perhaps makes more talking point, even when you're not supposed to be sort of focusing on it. You also, of course, talk about the mindset issue that we have about, you know, how matrimonials are still looking for the fair and lovely bride. No, absolutely. And even in my Facebook post, I have pronounced something which is very deep-rooted. I don't know whether it is caste and then skin tone or whether it's skin tone first and then caste, but it's also related to our biases of caste and class. And that is why it is so deep rooted. And that's why it is so problematic. And that's exactly why I thought I have to voice my opinion. Because a popular show like this, this show apparently is extremely popular on a very popular channel. Mm. I mean, don't they even think what they're doing? Is it uneducation? Is it like they're not literate? 
or is it that they are also victims i am i want to know that i feel maybe they are also victims of the same prejudice right hopefully we will hear so, for, some response for me you know it is right hopefully we'll hear some response uh, i'm trying to reach out the to the organizers yeah r- reach out to these these people who create this kind of content hmm. right we'll of course uh, try and like i said uh, get a response from them as well and see just what they were going through the point of course that you've made is that they told you that it was a roast and didn't you know that uh, you know you ought to be prepared for this but perhaps uh, you know they didn't realize what they were in for like you're saying this deep rooted prejudices that we still have yeah, to deal with l- i'll give like, you the last like word I on said, this one this is this is hmm. not at all personal hmm. yeah this is not at all personal i wish they had made fun of me they did not do that and they need to understand and everyone needs to understand that propagating such ideas even if it is relevant and pre- prevalent sorry if it is prevalent in our societies popular shows also have a responsibility you cannot keep propagating something which is right. wrongly prevalent in our society my voice is that right i'm voicing a protest against that and let's hope that your protest sort of uh, is taken in the right spirit and and people get what you're saying that's of course the point that you're making that perhaps they were not realizing just just how far they had taken this and it was of course far from uh, funny tanishtha thanks very much uh, for your time in bringing up one of those key prejudices that india has to deal with even in this day and age thanks for joining us there